Hey, what's going on everybody? Hoi here. Welcome back to a brand new video on the channel. And today, guys, we'll be continuing our Let's Play on Star Wars A Jedi Fallen Order. So, on a previous episode, we arrived on a Bagano and uh, we found a friend, uh, BD1. And now we are going to be heading our way to uh, the Jedi Temple. So, let us get right into it. So, this planet has been very, very, very quiet, which honestly scares me. Not going to lie. All right, so we made it across, so we're getting closer to the temple. I wonder what's inside. There's like a blue aura right there, huh? All right, what is this? Okay, so it's showing us the map. Uh, blocked, available. Certain paths will be inaccessible to Cal until he yeah, unlocks an ability. Switch elevation uh, to highlight different areas of the map. Okay, seems pretty easy. Okay, so then we have to go down there, so we got to take a detour. The next object added to the hollow map. All right, explore Bergano to find a way across. Okay. All right, sounds like a plan. So I guess we can't head this way. So I guess we got to do, a, like I said, a detour. Where was the place? So we have to go down there. But there's an enemy, so we should watch out for that. Wait, actually, let me jump and slice and dice. And there we go. Oh, what is over here? There's like a box. Ooh. Maybe a new lightsaber part? Hopefully it is a new lightsaber part because if it is, that would be actually pretty sick. All right. Ooh, it's a new um, cosmetic for Cal. That's actually pretty interesting. All right. But I want to keep him in his default. I honestly enjoy his default look. Okay, so now that we made it here, where exactly? We could go there, honestly. And then I think that's where exactly where we're supposed to go. Because over here um, is blocked off. Wait, there's a blue aura around here. So let me... Take that blue aura so then we could get some XP from that. Okay. Yeah, no, I think that's the way that we actually have to go. Because there's no other way we could go because that way leads us back. And I don't think we have unlocked the ability to go up, what's it called, uh, zip line. So, I think we have to go down. So, let us go down. Oh, I already see an enemy. Okay, so let me explore the area a little bit to see. All right, here we go. Slice and dice again. All right, easy. Oh, God, we got to watch out. What the heck? That's a huge robot. Okay, so let me just l watch them fight. And now let me attack this guy. Oh, God. Oh, snap. All right. Okay, dodge. Okay, there we go. All right, now it's my turn to attack. Dodge again. Okay. Oh, that's... We have to dodge. Okay. There we go. Keep on dodging. And I think we should be able to get him on the next hit. Oh, God. And there we go. He has been defeated. Now it's your turn, buddy. And you weren't even a challenge, damn. That's kind of sad, not going to lie. So, now that we have that guy, ooh, we can scan him. Why would we want to scan Look at his tongue. <laughs> That's actually amazing. All right, so now that we have that done, we can continue on our path. Wait, can we scan this enemy? Okay, thank you, BD1. Okay, so now that we have uh, that... Let's go over here and see. Whoa, that's an enemy. Okay, where did you come from, buddy? I didn't even see you. Okay, so I don't think we could scan. So I don't think we could access this because I think we need the push. Uh, the push? The force push so we could um get through there. So for now, I don't think that's a good uh, thing. Over here, we can't even access either because we need the wall jumping ability, which uh, we don't have yet. Okay, so for now, I guess the only path we could take... Is over here where we could actually jump up. So hopefully this is actual the actual path that we can go. Alright. Let's go up. Up and away. Okay, so now we made it to a meditation point. Okay, so what happens if I go back here? So that's a wall jump area, which I don't think we can access at this time. And that leads us just back down. So I guess this is the actual way that we have to go, which is, uh, I guess, pretty exciting. We're getting closer to the Jedi Temple. So now that we made it here, where exactly do I have to go? There's an entrance there. There's a blue aura there, which I don't think I could... Oh, I'd even try to. I'd even jump. Oh, God. That guy's going to appear out of nowhere. And we're just going to attack him. And there you go. Wait, can we scan him again? Oh, we're going to scan the water. Interesting. Oh, we got one of more uh, one more of these guys. There we go. All right. Ooh, he's going to scan another thing. Oh, he's going to scan the um, the plant. Ooh, that's an interesting to scan. All right. So now that we have uh, that done, we could get back up here and I think the only path we have left to actually take is the path that I saw earlier, but let me actually check around 
Yeah, because we can't do this because we don't have the wall jumping ability. So for now, I guess we just got to move on. Well, what the heck are those creatures? Those are weird. They look like fish slash... I don't even know. We can't even access over here either because what's it called? Wall jumping. What was that white light right there? That was kind of weird. Okay, so now that I have... I don't even know where to go, to be generally honest. Um... Wait, let me check the map. Okay, so this is exactly where I want to go. But the question is, how the heck am I supposed to get... Maybe I'm supposed to go this direction? Maybe? Let me just go this direction. I was about to hit the wall. Okay. Wait, there's a platform over there that I think I could be able to reach. Um, Let me actually check if I could reach it. I think I can. Yeah, I can. All right, let me drop down, actually, and then let BD scan this. What is this? It's like a wall. Ah, oh, interesting. All right, so we made it over here, but we can't wall jump. So that is a huge issue at the moment because we can't wall jump. What is that blue thing coming out? Look at all the animals. Those are like fish, like lizard combined. Oh, what the heck? A blue aura. What is this? Um, We're like in a nightmare scene. What? This is so weird. Huh? What does... What are we supposed to do? Uh, okay, so we can't do anything there. Um, what is this supposed to do? Oh, did we just unlock the wall jumping ability? Oh, wait, it's a flashback. Difficult, master. Ooh, we're going back in the day when uh, Kel was being trained by his master. But with persistence and the force as your ally, you will overcome any obstacle. All right, sounds like a plan. Now, do what you must to reach me. Okay, sounds like a plan. Okay, seems pretty easy. Oh, I just failed. Okay, so am I just supposed to... Wall jump? Okay, so I kind of glitched it. Not gonna... Oh. Oh, that isn't good. Alright, let us go on top now. I'm literally failing at this. Alright, so we're supposed to wall jump there. Now wall jump there. Alright. There we go, we got a wall jump, and now we make it over here, and uh, I think we unlocked the ability, wall run ability. So now that we have that activated, we could actually access, uh, what's it called, certain areas now that we couldn't before, like the area before that we uh, couldn't. So now let us try to get up here, because I think there is something up here. Oh, I screwed that up terribly, oh god. Alright, so how the heck am I, am I even supposed to go up there? Alright, let me just press... And try again. If it doesn't work, then I will not try it again. Oh, snap. Nope, it did not work. All right, whatever. All right, so now I don't think this is the area that we have to use it. So I think we have to head back to where we were originally. So now that we could uh, use that ability to get across to the Jedi Temple, which is actually pretty useful because now, like I said, we could uh, access the Jedi Temple. Think you can show me that shortcut again? Okay, so where exactly do I have to go? Okay, so right there. So then we could go over here. Okay, sounds like a plan. All right, so now that we have this ability, we could do so much more. Okay, so we could actually access this area. Okay, jump, jump, and now we could access this blue aura right here. Or is this echo, I should say. All right, so now that we have that, we could get XP. Okay, so now that we have that, we could head back, right? Oh, God, we fell. Oh, snap, how do I get back? Oh, we're over here. Okay. So now that I have that, I could go over here and access this. And now we could climb up and see what's up here. Oh, we get it. This is the way back. Okay, that's actually interesting. I did not know that. And now that we have this ability, we could uh, go over here and actually, well, jump across this gap. There we go. And there we go. And easy. And now we can make it on this platform. Which should let us go up and near the area with the dead end. I think it did, yeah. Okay, that's actually perfect. Okay, but where do I go exactly? Uh, oh, this is the way back. Okay. So now that we have that, we could head over here. And then go up 
here. Come on, I gotta jump. Jump, and a jump, and jump, and jump, and there we go. Okay, so now that we made it up, I could go over here, and now we can get across. Yes, let's go, and easy peasy, and now we are actually close to the Jedi Temple. It took a long time to get here, but we actually managed to get here, so that is amazing. Ah, oh, BD thinks he could erase us. And I think he's winning at the moment. Alright, let's climb this huge hill. Oh, I wonder what's inside. Okay. Let us meditate so we could save. Because I don't want to restart all of this. Okay, so we could rest. Uh, res uh, resting will respawn enemies. Which sounds perfectly fine. And we have one skill point. But I'm going to save up. Just in case so we could get, um, what's it called, another ability later on that's more powerful than just one skill point. Alright, so now let us uh, see this area and see what's going on. Alright, let's get in the area. What It's like that blue aura that we found earlier when we unlocked that, um, what's it called well, when we unlocked the wall jumping ability? What the heck? He just opened it. That's sick. He just opened, he just cracked it. I wonder what that is. I hope uh, they explain that. That would be actually sick. I wonder what it is. Oh, okay. So I guess uh, we got to go deep down into the Jedi Temple, the vault. Okay. Alright, so now that we made it here to the Jedi Temple. Um, what are we supposed to do? Oh, BD's going off. Let's scan this area. Maybe we'll find something. It looks like a Pokemon ball. Oh, we got a cutscene. What is this? You alright, BD? Well done, whoever you are. You have Who is that? Is that a, like a Jedi Master? And gained access to the vault and this recording, one of many encrypted logs stored in the droid. I Wait, so was this the droid that we were supposed to find? Because uh, the person that uh, your Seer your said that we were supposed to find a friend here. So was it BD1? Or BD? I'm, honestly, I'm going to call him BD Place from now on. Vault is a sacred temple. All right. Built by a vanished civilization known as the Zepho. The Zepho? Meditating That's an interesting here, name. That's so cool, but it's such a weird design, too, because it's just, like, opened. It's like a circle, and then with water in it. Inside this vault, a Jedi holocron. Okay. Containing a list of the names and locations of young Force sensitives throughout the galaxy. Oh. Ahead, you will find the inner chamber of the vault, but huh. also another test. I can only trust this holocron to someone who has followed my path and understands. As a Jedi? Seek out the hidden tombs of the three sages. Okay, so I guess we got our next the objective. The Force, as the Zepho once did. In this droid, you will find everything you need to succeed on this journey. Okay, Go sounds like a plan. There, you will find peace in the eye of the storm. Mm-hmm, okay. Good luck, Jedi. Alright, so I guess now we got our next Maybe mission of finding these three vaults on three different planets, I'm pretty sure. Okay, sounds like a plan. Cal's so confused. <laughs> I guess you were the someone I was supposed to meet. Huh, interesting. I like how Cal just jumps in the water. Doesn't even take time to, like, think about it. You know, I've been alone for a while now. Without any purpose, just hiding. This is true. He's been hiding. No I wonder how many years he has been I'm hiding. Right. Probably a long time because when, um... Right. Probably when we saw him train earlier in this right. episode where we learned a wall jumping trick. Maybe he was very right. young, so I'm his I'm assuming that he, uh, he was probably alone. He probably, his master died when he was young. So he was alone and hiding. I still love that lightsaber that we made. It looks so cool. Okay, so now that we have that, I'm assuming that we're gonna head back to the ship. And yeah, we unlocked a new destination, Zepho. Or Zepho. I think it's Zepho. Alright, so now let us head back out from this tomb. And now let us go to the ship so then we could actually go... Towards, uh, what's it called? Uh, towards, like uh, the planet. We'll be waiting. Alright, sounds like a plan. Hopefully nothing happens on the way, right? Okay, so my question is... Oh, snap. Who are you? Okay. You think you're clever. Alright, come on. Out, oh, out. Oh, there we go. We blocked. Come on. There we go. We blocked again. That was actually a super... Oh, God. 
There we go. Damn, we're doing good on the combat. It's insane, even though when I said that I got hit. But it doesn't matter. Yeah, stay down, buddy. Okay, so now that we have that, what is the fastest way to head back to the ship? We could go this way, where I was heading towards. Okay, so I can't go up, right? I haven't unlocked... What the heck is that creature right there? That's a huge... Wait, can we even access that area? I don't think we can. That's a huge creature. That reminds me of, like, a scorpion or something. Okay, so I think I went the wrong area, because this doesn't really allow me to do anything. Yeah, no, this is the same way we went to access the temple. So for now... I guess we gotta find a different way. So let us go back here. Okay. So now that we made it here. We can't do anything there. So I guess we gotta continue on in this direction. Which is gonna lead us... Ooh, that's like a dinosaur bone. Oh, that is like a dinosaur bone. Okay, so we made it here. Let's jump down. Is there anything around? No, there isn't. It's just a banded workshop. Ooh, actually, we could go down. Ooh, uh, is this accessible? No, it isn't. Okay. All right. That's fine. It's all good in the hood. And now, let us continue on. Ooh, what is this? Okay, we fell. Can we get back up? Yeah, we can. Okay. Okay. There we go. Easy peasy. All right. So, now that we made it here. Oh, what are you going to scan? What is that? I can't tell what that is. It looks like a planet type thing. I don't even know. Huh. My friend. I wonder what Jedi that is. That seems like an interesting interest Jedi that I don't in death, No, he hasn't been in anything else, I think. I'm actually interested to see to what Jedi that is, because like a that's a new character for me. And maybe uh, it is an original character that what's it called Disney made for this game. Or EA made for this game, I should say, because I think EA owns the rights to the Star Wars games. Okay, destination unlocked at Dathomir. Okay, sounds like a planet. Wait, isn't that Darth Maul's planet? I think that is. Okay. Oh, wait, this door is accessible um, from the other side, and this was where we were originally. Okay, so now that... Oh, um, that's kind of awkward, not gonna lie. Not gonna lie at all. Okay, so now that we have that, I think we have to go this direction. All right. Let's go, let's go, let's go. All right. Let me go up. Okay. Alright. So we made it back to the ship. Oh god. And I fell right into a hole. What is this? Oh my lord. Jeez. Okay. Oh snap. I literally just fell right in the Oh, that isn't good. Ow, ow. How do I get out? Stem. I need a stem. Alright. Oh, ooh, okay. He attacks twice, so I gotta watch out for that. Okay, okay. I I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. Okay, come on back up. Okay. Oh my lord, this man doesn't stop attacking. Okay, there we go. Okay. Oh, snap. Okay, let me back up. Back up. Oof. This is close. Oh god. Come on. Oh! Okay, yeah, nope. Not dealing with that. Alright, I'm out. Okay, I am certainly out. So now that I made it out, how do I get back? That's my question. Because we are literally about to die. Which is uh, not a good at all. Okay, I see where. Okay. Okay. I like how I fell straight in that hole. I didn't even see it at all, which is insane. Jeez. Alright, it's whatever. Because now that we have that, we have a meditation pad right here. So then we could regen all our health and we could get our stems back. Okay. There we go. Actually, actually, this is what I could actually do. I could go here, and I said that I was going to wait, but I could increase Cal's maximum force. That uh, Let's increase Cal's maximum life. Let's do that, because I think that will come in use very much in this game. So now that we have that, we have restored everything, and we restored the enemies around this area. So we should be careful. And this time, hopefully, I don't fall in the hole, because if I fall in the hole, I am actually going to be mad for the second time. But hopefully this time we are prepared. Okay, so now we can go around it. I'm not going to fall back down. Because I'm not that stupid. That, wow, that's so ironic. Not going to lie at all. I'm not going to fall in the hole. Literally almost falls in the hole. Only my luck, honestly. Only my luck. Only Jorge's luck. 
All right, so we made it back to the ship. What are these guys? These guys look like small Ewokers, like a ripoff from Ewoks. Okay, so now that we made it back. Ooh, what? BB... BD. I was about to call him BB-8. What are you scanning? Oh, you're scanning the animals. Bo a boggling tunnel. Okay, so boggling is maybe the name. Okay, so where exactly do we have to go? Okay, we have to go over here to talk to see I'm pretty sure her name is. All right, we made it back. We made a friend. So you knew about BD-1? <laughs> Come on board. We'll talk inside. All right, sounds like a plan. Oh, BD-1, this is Grease. Hey, Grease. What is that? Get off my sofa! Get, get off my sofa! Oh, oh, damn. Okay. That is BD-1. He's with us. I don't care who he's with. Do you have any idea how hard it is to get oil stains out of... What the heck? Damn, he just kicked him, uh, BD, out of the coach. You found something better out there than this droid. Calm down, Grease. He did. Tell us, Cal. I like how our lightsaber is gold. Look at that. That is pure gold. A Jedi named Eno Cordova hid something inside of it. What did he hide inside? The holocron, right? In the archives. With all the children. It contains a list of force sensitive children. Mm-hmm. And that's the bad if someone gets uh their children. hand on it. I knew it. Oh, Cordova, you old fool. You knew him? Yes. A long time ago. I was his apprentice. Cordova was Huh. Born. That little droid and I are probably the only ones that know about Pagano. Hold on, wait a minute, wait a minute. Oh, so oh, BD oh, was uh, the Jedi's droid, huh? Accessible to Jedi. Hang on, I think I have one around here. Oh, it's a holocron. That's actually sick. That's like the one uh, Obi-Wan placed in the temple for the Jedi that still remained. Oh, my controller's vibrating. That's actually pretty sick. This is Master Obi-Wan <gasps> It's the message. What the heck? I did not expect that. That's so cool. Obi Wan made an appearance. We didn't get to see his face or his design. We we saw his beard. I saw his beard and his hair, but we didn't get to see his face. That's actually super cool. I didn't know that he was in this game. That's so cool. Yes, it uh, is uh, three planets and three temples. All right, well, where are we going? I'm just asking because I was thinking of maybe making some food. <laughs> Look, before we do anything, I need to know something. What do you need to know, Cal? How come you're no longer a Jedi? This is true. Did you, like, get I out of, get, uh, it. did you quit the Jedi Order or something? My perspective. Did so you pull I off, uh, Soka Tano? <laughs> from the Force. But you still want to rebuild the Order. I believe that rebuilding the order is the best chance we have against the Empire. Yeah, I don't think it is. Do uh, <laughs> Luke Skywalker tried that a uh, few I mean, years later, I and uh, that Empire went down so the, really <laughs> the whole choice. very you fast. Alive, you will always have a choice. But it's better to try, right? And then trying nothing. We're in. All right. Dathomir Zepho, it's your choice. Alright, so I guess that, that is it. So now we're going to be traveling to another world on the next episode of Star Wars Jedi Fallen Order. So I'm going to end it off here, guys. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, be sure to smash that like button below for more Star Wars Jedi Fallen Order on the channel. If you haven't already, be sure to subscribe to the channel. And yeah, hope you guys enjoyed it. Peace out, Jorge.